Aqua Soul family, what it do? It's your girl, Empress 777 here today with a general love message for my Aqua gang. What's up, you guys? Hope you're doing fantastic. I certainly am. As you can see, we're still in our little unwind space, so go grab yourself a beverage. Go grab yourself a beverage, and we're gonna get into this, all right? We're gonna try to keep it cute, y'all, okay? I'm gonna try to keep it cute, but... I be want to curse y'all people out. I'm just saying. You like, girl, you. We already cursed their ass. I'm just saying. They just be like, it's almost like somebody has something to prove. I don't think they're trying to prove something to you or to, I think they're trying to prove something to themselves in reference to getting you back, but in the exact same way. Like I can get Aqua back and I can get Aqua to do the exact same thing that I got Aqua to do before. It's just annoying. I digress. Let's let's go ahead and jump in because I can't hold it in anymore. Okay. Take a moment and click that like button, guys. As well as the subscribe button and the notification bell because I do upload for us quite often on this channel. Now, I did try uploading for other signs, you guys. I don't know if I put my foot in my mouth on that thing or not because it took a lot of energy out of me. I don't know if I'm going to be able to um, keep that up. It didn't seem to come to me organically. So, but we'll see. Anyway, I digress. I feel like I'm venting to you guys. You know, we're friends. We're friends. You guys get me. All right. Let's see exactly what we have for Aquarius. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs is general. So take what resonates and lead the rest. You already know how that goes. Cross watchers, place yourself where you belong in the story. Period. Yeah. 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 Eight of Wands in the reverse. And where I would normally view the Eight of Wands as a sign of somebody wanting to, um, bring things to a stop the way that i'm feeling this is somebody does not want to change shit up the way that you move forward they're not trying to move forward in a different way they want to halt you in your tracks like where do you think you're going like what do you think you're doing oh you're elevating oh you're expanding oh you're growing oh your bank account is growing oh you don't i'm not your type anymore oh you think you're different now oh you try oh you reintroduced yourself as who no you're still the same motherfucker that i thought you were how about i show you that that's what i feel Ew, oh my god this is like can you work on yourself ma'am sir brussis why are you so pressed why are you so worried about what aqua is doing and how aqua is expanding it's almost as if this person is like i bet you i bet you i bet you i bet you i bet my mama i bet it on my mama i put this on my mama that i can get aqua back the same way that i had them before they won't be different you might be showing a different side of yourself to everyone in your life you're not the same person but I mean, isn't that normal? Like progression, evolution, evolving. It's a thing, dummy. It's a thing. Evolving is imperative if you're trying to grow some shit. So you can't stay the same. So I feel like this person is mad that you changed. It's almost like they did shit just to spite your changes. And you may have even let this person go because of that. Oh my gosh. Can't deal with this. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. This could be a Leo that we're talking about, right? Um, we have lots of fire here. So Leo, Sag, Aries. That doesn't necessarily have to be their sign, but that's what's showing up. That's what's showing up right now. Very, very stubborn individual. A know-it-all. Big mouth. Ain't saying nothing. Like, don't have nothing good to say. This person doesn't have any good ideas, any good advice, any good, you know, structure. So they're trying to be extremely quiet with this plan. They may even say some things to lead you to believe that they are trying to make certain changes or that, you know, they would need you to be patient with them during the changes that you're trying to make. OK. If you've already disconnected yourself from this person, then they will be back. <laughs> you're like, no, <laughs> they will. They will. They will, okay? We have the Ace of Wands in the reverse and it will be the exact same way though, okay? No matter what their words are saying, don't listen to the chit chit chatter, okay? Because this person can talk a good game. They might be a wordsmith, they might be a finesser, like a, a professional finesser. That's what I feel. That's what made me the most angry because what they're saying is not what they plan to do. Their motives are completely different than what they might be spitting to you, right? Spitting game. This is someone who is unmotivated, right? They are, they don't do well with change. Now, Aquarian is a fixed sign, right? So we don't do well with change either, right? Naturally, 
We need things to change in a way that makes sense. There's a difference, right? We're all about evolution. I say we, cause I'm an Aquarian as well, right? Can y'all agree with me down in the comments? That's the truth. We are all about evolution. Shit is always changing. It's always something better. It's always onto the next thing, onto the next thing, right? Another plan, another expansion, another way to grow, another way to be better. That's what we're all about. That doesn't mean that we necessarily deal well with shit changing swiftly that don't make sense. It has to make sense. Right. And if it don't make sense, changes are out of our control. But the changes that don't make sense piss us the fuck off. Like, what are you doing, universe? They don't make sense. Like, why did you make me this way? If you was going to start changing shit in my life that don't make sense, that I have no control over that, that'll be some, some shit that'll piss you the fuck off. But natural changes and things that you organically can relate to, you're all about. You're all about change. Now, this is an individual who's unmotivated towards all change. They don't like it. They don't like the way that you change. They don't like how you're talking now. They don't like how you're dressing now. They don't like who your new friends are. They don't like who you're hanging around. They don't like the new job you got. They don't like the new business ventures you into. They don't like that you now want to invest. Are you in stocks? Are you think you better? Are you think you better? Right? So it's almost like now they have to prove. They got something to prove. Oh my gosh. Why did y'all drag me into this shit? <laughs> I want out of here. I want out. We're doing this read a little bit different this time, guys. Okay, I just feel the need to intuitively clarify. It's very rare that I do uh, tarot without any oracles, but that's just what I'm feeling today. We might pull a few oracles before we go over to the extended, okay? New love will be in the extended because how about you prove it to Jesus? Because I'm out of here. Like, you're gone. Dust. That's what they're going to find. That's what, that's what they're going to find, okay? Ashes to ashes, dust to dummies. You're the number one dummy, right? You wanted to be first in line. <laughs> you wanted to be number one. You in first place. You in first place. You in first place. You the, you the number one dummy. Like, for real. Somebody please get this motherfucker a reward. Where is their, where is their trophy? They need a trophy out this bitch. It's ridiculous. This is fucking ridiculous. <laughs> and I'm annoyed. I said I was going to try to keep it cute. You like, girl, you over here singing two chains and shit. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Okay, they in first place. Dumb ass contest, you in first place. Like, <laughs> please. This is ridiculous. They mother need an ass whooping. Why'd you let this person grow up to be so dumb? You didn't teach your child nothing. You ain't teach them nothing. They ain't got no schooling, they ain't got no home training, they ain't got no street smarts, they ain't got no book smart, like just nothing. Just out here winging it. Brainless. <laughs> we have the emperor, see? Like, come on. How could you even think that you are on this? Motherfucker, you are not this. This is not you. You are not this. You don't even come close to this. <sighs> this is annoying. So the way I'm viewing the emperor clarifying this eight of swords in the reverse is this person feels like you should view them as first place now we do first place dummy but they want you to view them as upper echelon the king the queen the motherfucking king the motherfucking queen like you need to bend to my will follow my rules stop changing shit and you're like but i want to grow like <laughs> but i want a family but i want to i want a home one day i want to own some shit i want assets not liabilities motherfucker like you're a liability at this point and they're like, oh, for real? Oh, word? Oh, word? Well, now I'm going to prove it to you that you will take me back. And I will be in charge. And I will be the king. And I am going to make the rules, okay? You're going to be under my ruling. <laughs> Yikes. Yikes. Who is this? This person is crazy as fuck, y'all. This is a crazy motherfucker. This person is crazy. You already know that they're cuckoo. They are a loony too, okay? Bye. Four or five fries short of a Happy Meal. They are stressed, not stressed, stressed. Okay, we have an illiterate one. They can't read, can't write, they ain't got no brain, they ain't go to school, they ain't do none of that shit, right? Stressed. You are stressing them the fuck out with all these changes and all this shit you trying to do. Why you can't just be regular like the rest of us? <laughs> oh my God. 
Oh my gosh. Who told him that an Aquarian was a regular person? Like, we're not regular people. We the stars, bitch. Okay, like, get in line. The fuck? Who is this? They definitely did not know you, whoever this was. I don't know how long or how much time you gave this person, but for them to think that this control, manipulation, fakery, fuckery, foolery, fuck boy, fuck girl shit was over this, it's just like the math ain't mathing. Like this person didn't go to math, Empress. What are you talking about? <laughs> Saying it's it's simple arithmetic. Okay? Simple. I'm stressed out. Now I'm stressed. Who is this? I'm just gonna grab a few oracles and then we're going over to the extended. saying that this person thought that they was on your level they thought that they were above you and it's just absurd it is absurd and they can't believe that you're now that they now have to sit in a space where they they can kind of see <laughs> with their own eyes that they are clearly not above you like they definitely do not have the the tools the brain power the wherewithal the ideas the structure to navigate through life the way that you do and you've been changing you try to help them change too and they're just like i don't want that i want to be in charge stop changing i want to be in charge <laughs> like it's ridiculous this is some ridiculous shit i can't i cannot i don't i can't deal with stupidity i don't do well with stupidity i don't karmic for sure karmic even twin flame for some of you this twin flame is beyond sleep they in a fucking coma okay I, 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 I can't I can't for sure say that union is possible in this lifetime because in the twin flame journey in order for union to ever be possible both twins need to be awakened you both have to learn some shit the lessons have to be learned you have to be awakened you have to be on the same level playing field to be able to move forward right and it often starts in shambles this shit is for sure in shambles okay it started that way it's still this way you have done your work clearly okay you're sitting pretty lovely gorgeous Fun as fuck. <laughs> damn, daddy, how you doing? Right? Like, damn, I'm a, how you doing? Like, mm, good. You look good. You're looking good, okay? <laughs> Money good, body good, face good, like car good, house good, okay, job good, all that. But your twin? Man. <laughs> oh my gosh impoverished i'm just gonna say that okay they are in poverty i just can't yeah <laughs> you can't make this shit up literally okay currency comes in many of different ways not just monetarily i say that all the time it doesn't have to just be the dollar amount even though it is in a lot of ways for this person they thought that they was running this shit okay who run it <laughs> who run it <laughs> who run it how many of y'all know that old school 3-6 Mafia? Y'all like, girl, you are ratchet. No, I'm clatchy, okay? Classy and ratchet. Okay, both. I give you a little bit of both. They felt like they was running this shit. And they are lacking in more ways than one, more than monetary. Their currency is lacking in damn near all areas. I can't tell you one thing that this person had good to offer to this shit moving forward. They may have done it for you at the start of the connection because it was divine. So the emotions, right? Even the physical attraction, some of that shit might have done it for you. But as an Aquarian, it's always about forward movement and they just have not been able to move with you and they can't stand that you're trying to move this shit now. They want you to sit the fuck down. <laughs> sit your ass down stop trying to always get to a bag stop trying to always expand stop stop worrying about generational wealth like it's dumb it's just man i'm sorry that you guys had to deal with this yeah, it's too much they wanted to just stay the same they want you to just be content 
with what they came with at the beginning of this shit and stop trying to make them do more. Oh my God. I'm going to the extent it because I can't take this. I'm, I'm, I'm going to start cursing. Every word that I'm about to say is about to be a cuss. So we got to go. Okay. And I hope you'll join me. So we're going to go over to the extended. I want to see what can you expect for the future of this connection? Okay, what, 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 what can we expect moving beyond this? What's the potential outcome of this shit? Whether you decide to re-engage with this person or not, it is a divine connection. So it's easier said than done to say, get the fuck away from this shit, right? I also want to go ahead and look at this person's next steps and their intentions so that you can prepare yourself. Let's see what karma is approaching this person directly. They are impoverished. Let's not. Forget that. So we're going to get some details about, about, um, about that. I definitely want to see what exactly that's going to entail. And then we're going to get the subconscious blockages that might be stagnating your growth beyond this. Let's also take a look to see what the lesson is that spirit needed you to learn in order to move quickly into the next cycle. And have you learned that lesson? I definitely am curious about that. And then we will get into your what? <laughs> New love message. I feel as though dealing with this shit and getting beyond this shit the way that you have been able to for the majority of you or you will the star card like baby it don't get no better this is you showing up in your own read as exactly who you are like your true divine authentic self so new love is about to be on one i already can feel it i feel it i just feel it so let's see what or whom is approaching you in this next cycle only new and only the good shit i also want to see how can you best prepare to ensure that you are becoming and remaining invisible to all toxicity that's very important because of the work that you've done you want to keep it that way let's also see what the potential for union in this next cycle is for you and what signs and synchronicities can you look out for from spirit to signify that you have met your divine counterpart because this is about divine timing and this was not the right timing for this connection not saying that it won't be possible in the next lifetime i don't see it for this lifetime i'll just be honest with you right not saying it's not possible in the next lifetime but you're not always meant to be with your twin flame or with a certain soulmate in said lifetime right there are many others to come so your divine counterpart is the one who you're supposed to be with in this lifetime what you need to look out for what's the sign that they're going to give you that you've met that person i need to know so do you i also want to see the focus advice of course what is the divine's focus advice on how to manifest the life of abundance in which you desire in the least amount of time so we have a lot to unpack first click that like button if you do not mind also click the subscribe button okay and the notification bell and yeah, I'm going to see y'all over there, okay? I'm going to link it down below. Hopefully you follow me over there, and I'm going to see you over in the extended.